This is a very short video showing multi-threaded logging. I have a simple form here with a button on it and we'll look at the code here. And the code, instead of using the config to create a logger, I'm programmatically doing it just to show you that how easy it is to do that also. So here I'm creating a file logger and I have a button click method here that basically creates a background thread which the work is done in the start logging method and this method also creates 20 background threads and then it will wait for the threads to finish and it will pop up a message box saying done the background threads here call this do log method and each one of those logs writes to the logger a thousand times so basically we have 20 threads writing to the same logger at the same time and they're trying to log a thousand times each so I'll start this up the video capture program running on my machine slows it down quite a bit it's a dinosaur of a machine anyway but I'm gonna click the button then I will pause my video capture and I'll come back when it's done so that you don't have to sit here okay it's done the magic of video so I'll click that close the application and we'll look at the file here open it up and I've just written out numbers corresponding to the what logger thread it is and then you know what number what iteration we're on and if we scroll through the file it starts to mix up as we go through so you know each thread is competing to write to the log file and it's up to Windows to decide which one gets priority at the moment and they all get written out no problem no conflicts nothing so let me delete that and we'll go back here and just one final thing I want to show you real quick what happens if we wrap this in an async logger so that the logging itself is asynchronous and you'll see that if I this up here and click the button now it's done right away I didn't pause the video basically the logging got done extremely quickly it's still writing out to the file system but the application can continue working uh, much more efficiently this way using an async logger that quick and Another difference too is when it actually does finish writing out to the file system, if you looked at the timestamps, all those logs were logged in that moment that we clicked the button and it said done. They were already written. So the timestamps will be almost identical. And that's it. Multi threading without a problem using the Lung framework.